watching WSBT First at Four. In the last 10 years, the number of farmers markets has tripled across the country. Michiana has also witnessed that trend. South Bend Tribune columnist Heidi Prescott has details about a local farmers market, though, that is planning some pretty big changes. Hi, Heidi. Hi, Jennifer. The Granger Farmers Market is closing its doors on Saturday, but the co-founder is optimistic that she'll find a new location and reopen this summer. When this happens, though, which will likely be in June, the market's going to transition back to an open-air market. That's how it started almost five years ago. A handful of local farmers got together and sold vegetables under a covered pavilion that was behind between the buns. As the market grew and it moved indoors and tried opening year-round, you know, it never had enough vendors or the right combination to compete against the other farmers markets and co-ops in the area. There's something nice about that open-air concept that I think people will enjoy from the beginnings of how this first started, too. You know, as this market prepares to close, you have details about a business that is getting ready to reopen that's kind of exciting yeah just this morning I spoke to two local residents who are buying the carriage house in South Bend Joshua Bishop and Rodney Fields of Mishawaka are eager to reopen this restaurant they're looking at mid to late April they've both worked at the carriage house before and let me tell you they are passionate about food they're making cosmetic repairs right now inside and they're creating some new menu items but they emphasize that they are not making too many changes and in fact they cringed at the thought that someone else could have bought the carriage house and turned it into something that it's not all right so it'll stay the same you can read much more about this thank you heidi uh about the reopening of carriage house in heidi's column on sunday's tribune and uh, online southbendtribune.com